High Definition Haptic Rendering. Haptic perception is essential for dexterous object manipulation in both real and virtual worlds. From the feedback force, human perceives many things, such as shapes, dynamics, and materials. Conventional haptic rendering requires high-frequency simulation, around 1 kHz for stable control. However, high-frequency simulation of large-scale virtual worlds require much computational quantity. High dynamic range rendering for images is a good model to solve this issue. Usually, HDR images require HDR displays to be presented. On the other hand, HDR rendering reduces the dynamic range of HDR images for low dynamic range displays regarding human perception for images. High definition haptic rendering also regards human perception. Human perceive motion of object visually and prepare for impact force. However, time precision of human vision is not very accurate. So, low frequency simulation is enough for this impact force. On the other hand, Human perceives dynamics and shapes of objects from the relations between applied forces and motions via haptic sensors. Haptic sensors require smoothness and high frequency update. So we apply high frequency haptic rendering for this. Perception of materials from false vibrations also requires high frequency. First, let us consider perception of materials. Okamura et al. reported that even vibration generated from simple frequency and envelope model can generate perception of materials. We extend Okamura's model and integrate it to the haptic rendering. This is wood, and this is aluminium. This video records the sound emitted from the haptic interface. Users feel the perception of material even when their auditory senses are masked. Humans perceive dynamics of objects from the relation between applied forces and motion of objects. Presentation of this relation requires high frequency update and consideration to effects of all objects that are in contact with the objects touched by hands. So, we propose to approximate the relation between forces and motion into a linear model. Without the linear model, the consistency between local and global side is lost. With the linear model, all motions of objects are neat. As a result of low frequency update of global simulation, haptic interaction with lots of objects is realized. 